Game 5 of the NBA Finals. The Oklahoma City Thunder have everything to fight for. Their path is simple. Down three games to one in a must-win situation. They must bring tenacity, the heart, and an absolute will to win as they face elimination against the Miami Heat. This is the NBA Playoffs, and it's up next. Hey, what's swagging players? It's your boy Stax Montana, man. Back out here on this NBA 2K18 My Career featuring the sixth god himself. Killer Cam Baker, NBA Finals Game 5 back in Miami. And things can change tonight. We can become an NBA champion. And all we got to do is beat the Thunder without Paul George. Only Russell Westbrook. If you have not been keeping up with the series, it's been pretty crazy. Westbrook went down with an injury, but he's back to being 100% leaning, getting buckets. The sixth guy who, the sixth guy that had two 50-point games in the final so far. He been going in. He been in threes, running fast breaks. He been dunking. The sixth guy going in. Trying to win an NBA championship right now. Andre Robinson, I don't even know why you're shooting those threes. You're trash. You ain't got the yumper the way you think you got the yumper. Straight down the lane. Steven Adams got out the way. Well, not really out the way, but he didn't even try to contest that shot because if you notice, bro, throughout the playoffs, I mean, throughout the finals so far, Steven Adams been getting a whole bunch of foul calls. I think he even got fouled out of games twice. Kelly Olynyk wide open. Views from the tray. Kelly Olynyk. if we win the championship tonight, he should, well, not co. I ain't even going to flex because the sixth guy I've been doing the utmost in these finals. He just had a 30-20-20 game in game four. But Kelly Olynyk views from the tray. If you could pick a sub-finals MVP, it would definitely go to Kelly Olynyk, man. This guy has been balling. He has been carrying his weight throughout these finals. And I appreciate having him as a teammate. Now this man in my way. Get up out the way. Pull up game is the wrong. Oh, yeah. We going all the way in for the championship. This is an elimination game. We got to go in. We got to play our best. Big boy Felton going to the basket. Get it out of my house, boy. Shammy, let me get the ball going all the way. Leaning. Getting buckets. And we about to act a fool in this game, bro. You see it's close. The Thunder trying to make it a close game, but that's mostly because of Russell Westbrook. Russ been trying to carry this team. He just ain't got the talent around him right now. But most of all, the sixth guy been doing a whole bunch of this. All the way, slamming, dunking, Steven Adams are I. Boy, give me that ball. Andre Robinson, you ain't got the handles like that. This man Russ trying to guard you, boy. I just go ahead and throw it up anyway. That's a bucket. We being so relentless in this game right now, dog. We attacking so crazy. And I don't know why in these NBA Finals, Russell Westbrook been playing like Michael Jordan or Kobe. Not necessarily like Michael Jordan or Kobe, but he's been shooting a whole bunch of post fadeaways. And I don't know if that's because he hurt his ACL in game two. I don't know exactly why that is. But this man has been doing a whole bunch of post fadeaways. And honestly, he make like one out of six. Like literally. And this right here just happened to be the one he makes. You know what I'm saying? Over the double two. Yo, Russell Westbrook, I ain't gonna flex. He been playing amazing, shooting horrible, 6 for 16. But he got 19 points, 4 rebounds for a squad right now. Definitely trying his hardest to carry. But when you got the 6 guy, 6 8, coming down the lane, Euro stepping his way to greatness, it's, I mean, it's tough to counter that. Doug McDermott trying to stop your boy, but he can't stop your boy. Throwing the ball over to the homie Whiteside. He gets the layup. The pick and roll's been crazy. And Whiteside right there checking on his nose because you already know he got a broken nose somewhere in the playoffs. I forgot. I think it was in the Eastern Conference Finals against the Cavs, but he got hurt, broke his nose. Look at my boy Shammy playing defense. 
the sixth guy going to go all the way. Russ, get out the paint. Because you're not going to stop me from doing me ever. And we trying to go in right now. Start the second half. We up by two. It's a very close game. But the sixth guy said, man, we ain't trying to do that right now. That's not what we're interested in. Deion Waiters views from the tray. The six guys said we're not interested in playing a close game right now. That man Russ with the ball, he trying his hardest, throwing up another brick. And he take a lot of contested shots. That's why he been having horrible shooting percentages. But the six guy been taking them high percentage shots all night, all the way dunking once again. The six guy doing his thing right now. Beast. Doug McDermott, bruh. You've been having a hard time in these finals guard. When I'm out here making shots like that, just know your boy is on fire all the way. Unless I'm on fire, I mean all the way on fire. We going all the way in. Your boy with the ball again. Doug McDermott, you trying your hardest. Was going to try to set the screen for the homie. They double teamed me. Dragic wide open. Views from the tray. You got to make them pay for double teaming you. We only up by four. Thick boy Felton in his jump ball, bro. I don't know how the thick man ever thought he was going to win his jump ball. But, yeah, go ahead and have a seat. We out on the fast break. Try to hit him with a crossover. Try to hit him with something mean. He can't keep up with the speed. Look at the sauce. It's just all types of sauce, uh, uh, marinara sauce dripping from the sixth god boy, Parmesan sauce. I don't even know if that's sauce. I know it's a cheese, but I don't know if it's sauce. Westbrook with another contested shot, not looking so good. Crossover game crazy. Boy, you cannot guard a sixth guy. You're way too slow. And I'm going to the line for free throws. That's Steven Adams' first foul. He acting a fool. Relax, my guy. Relax. You don't need to be acting like that. Thick boy Felton with the tray ball. Knocked it down. It's a four-point game, man. I ain't going to flex the sixth guy going in. But the Thunder trying to hold their own. All the way going stupid. Dunk it. Yo, this is how confident this man Cam is right now, bro. He treating the NBA Finals. An elimination game in the NBA Finals like it's a slam dunk contest. Russell Westbrook with another trash shot. I don't know why he's doing that. He's shooting 6 for 22 right now. Remember, he was 6 for 16. 6 for 22 ain't going to work. Euro step. And one swag. For that man, Cam, Euro step in my way to greatness once again. Euro step, I'm European. The sixth guy, look at Thick Boy Felton trying to calm down Steven Adams. Steven Adams, super mad right now. You big mad or little mad, Steven Adams? Let me know. Look at all that contact right there, bro. You know that was a foul? You know that was a foul. Now I gotta go ahead and finish up this play and extend this lead with this free throw. Let me get it, ref, anytime you ready. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm ready. I'm always ready. I wake up ready. So, ref, whenever you feel like you need to give me that ball for me to pop this free throw, uh, you feel me? Let me go ahead and get it. And I'm going to take my time with this one, dog. We in the finals. We ready to hang up another banner. And one thing I, I just realized, right? In 2K right now, if, if right now I win the NBA Finals, will they really hang up another banner? Like, like in this arena, right now, in the Airlines Arena, will there be another banner? Also, like the, the number on the back of the jersey that show how many, oh my God, crossover, gang. Going back to the free throw line, but the number on the back of the jersey that show how many championships that team has won, will that number go up if we, you know what I'm saying? Like, will the Thunder get a number if they win? Because right now, the back of our jerseys, oh, get that out of here, Russ, what you doing? The back of our jerseys got the number three meeting, the Miami Heat won three um, championships, so will it go up to four after we win this game? Let me get that thing back, that's views. Yeah, views from the tray. These boys need a timeout every day. And the lead is going up like crazy. Cantor dunking. That was not a part of the plan. I didn't go for Cantor, you dunking right there was not a part of the plan. And your boy got to get back to these buckets. He can't guard me all the way. Easy layup. Cantor, I think that was a smart idea not to jump. That was just been an and one. You already know how we rocking out here. 
JJ with the ball. We still triple double chasing. But right now, we focusing on scoring. We focus on getting these buckets, bro. I didn't even flex. Shammy in the corner, though. Views from the tray. Whoa. Shammy is savage. We definitely got to make sure Shammy is back next year. We got to make sure the Sham God is playing in Miami next year. Now, look at this. I'm trying to hold for the last shot of the quarter. I probably should have did this in game two. The game where I missed the game winner. Look at the separation with the bucket. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Buckets at the buzzer. Why are these refs hating? And they literally about to sit here and check, but the six got flexing. He already know what it is. And right here, we're going to look at the nick of time. The six guy got the ball out his hands. I know a lot of haters was in the comments wondering if the six guy really got that shot off or not. But listen, no need to wonder anymore. No need to wonder anymore. You seen it. The call gonna be overturned. Give me 41 points going to the fourth quarter. The six out ain't playing, bro. Y'all about the box. Y'all about ball. But to start the fourth quarter, we back out here. We back out here. Getting ready to hoop. And just in case you thought that buzzer beater was amazing, check this out. 2K slowed me down, but I was thinking with the end. One. Swag. For that man, Cam. 2K legit just slowed me down on that fast break, but it's all good because I got the M1. I got the M1. Patrick Patterson, get up off me, boy. Throwing the ball up at the rim, that's the M1, you feel me? Something you might not know too much about, you know what I'm saying? Being that you are Patrick Patterson, and I am the sixth guy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we, we, we play two different positions, and we on two different levels right now, you feel me? I'm out getting hand ones trying to win the NBA Finals. You out here, you know, just trying to bring it back to OK. I mean, that's uh, OK. Okay, I, I get it. It's, it's an unfair comparison. But, you know, it's, it's still one that has to be said, being though he's the one that found But it's all good. 95%. The free throw drops. We're going to move on. The score right now is starting to get disrespectful. Uh, Patrick Patterson throwing up threes. And see, this is why the comparison must continue. Patrick Patterson, that was me. You know what I'm saying? I probably would have clapped that three. You know what I'm saying? I already hit a three in this game, so I ain't got to shoot another one. But look at Justice Winslow in the corner. Oh, whoa, 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 boy. Boy, get it together. Buckets, by the way. <laughs> Buckets, by the way. Six guy. Listen, man. I told you we up by 20. Well, never mind. Not no more. Cantor at the free throw line. Let's see what he's going to do. Well, I'm hoping he's going to get in the gym after this game. That's exactly what I'm hoping he's going to do. Crossover on Doug McDermott all the way down the lane. Another layup. And we making it look easy, bro. And I don't blame y'all. A lot of people... Claim that I don't play on Hall of Fame. I honestly wish they had the two-time verification at the end of games like they used to have a last year, but they don't got it no more for me to actually prove that I'm playing on Hall of Fame. But listen, I understand. When people be hitting me up saying, you ain't playing on Hall of Fame, man. Florida, by the way. <laughs> I understand. I really do understand, but I just want you to know I am playing on Hall of Fame, but, you know, it is what it is. It doesn't matter to me. If you believe me or not, it doesn't matter. Russ with the backcourt violation. Hey, that's tough. That's rough, cuz. That's rough. But hey, you know, we're we gonna, we gonna do something a little bit different. I understand y'all style on inbounds is right to get backcourt violations and all that stuff. So we're gonna change it up. We're just gonna give it to the sixth guy, get the floater, and keep it moving. You feel me? That's all we're gonna do. We're gonna get that floater and keep it moving. She was 60%. 52 points right now. The sixth guy is on the road. And on the road to score the most points in the NBA Finals ever. Boom, behind the back move. Trying to get the ball out of my hand. That was probably a travel, but Dragic, views from the tray. I appreciate you being there to help me out, my guy. I really do appreciate it. We trying to clamp up right here. Roberson with the three. Why do he shoot so many? Like, I would, I would never understand why he shoots so many threes in 2K. Crossover. All the way. Patrick Patterson, not again. Not again. And one swag here. That phone is for you, my guy. Because, uh... The sixth guy is calling. He he calling to say you can't stop him. Look at Pat Pat. Look at Patrick Brown. Oh oh my God. That's that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. You need to get in the weight room or something, bro. There's, there's no way I should have been able to just go up with that. He should have knocked me out the air or something. You know what I'm saying? I mean, don't do that though. I ain't trying to get injured. I'm actually trying to win the NBA final. But listen, it, it is what it is. 
Ref, let me get that ball. Let me get ready to shoot these free throws. The lead right now is crazy, but we go and try to extend that thing. You feel me? And go on to win an NBA title. A lot of people don't know. Oh, oh, green. Oh, oh, green. Just to go ahead and top it off, Patrick Pratt, I'm going to drop the green on you, my guy. Dougie McDermott right here looking. He thinking about trying to guard me, but he like, at this point, I, I, I might as well just fall back, pull up game strong. Green release. Oh, I just love those green releases. That's just all you hear. And all you hear is the net. Coof. I just, I just love that. Coof. I just love that. Coof right there. Westbrook with the post fadeaway again. Like, I don't even know how many post fadeaways that has been. I mean, contested shots he took in his game, but eh, it's, it's crazy out here. My boy Kelly Olenek wide open all the way. Easy layup. Easy layup. One assist away from the triple-double. Three minutes left in the NBA Finals, and at this point, you probably could call me. You could probably get called the sixth guy, the NBA champion. Going all the way, that man Dragic with the layup. And one swag triple double for the six. Just a heads up play by Dragic. 57 points. Getting the shot. More points than anyone has ever scored in an NBA Finals. I'm going to give it honor with y'all. I don't even know if that's true. But we're going to say it is just for the sake of, uh, yeah, the sixth guy. You're going to. Sick boy Felton with the ball. Time is winding down. And look at this chipmunk. Go we'll actually make the shot, but it does not matter. Do you know why? It's because we are NBA champions. NBA champions. We did every single thing we had to do. We balled out of control. We did our thing in the first one, in the second one, in the conference finals. But now, more than anything, we did our thing. And look at look, look, look at Deion Wade talking to his former coach. But more than anything. Actually, did he, did he play for Scott Brooks? But it doesn't matter. More than anything, we did our thing in the finals, and we are NBA champions. You already know what it is. Finals MVP, the sixth guy. We're just going to watch these highlights. How this man just balled out of control in game five of the NBA finals, an elimination game. You know what I'm saying? He went super crazy. Pulling up all crazy. Laying up all crazy. So much sauce. Oh, my God. Pull up game was strong, you know what I'm saying? Dunking on these boys, getting all of these and ones floater down the lane. You cannot deny that this man is the NBA Finals MVP. The people know it. We know it. We all know it. Six guy, man. I thank you guys so much for just following me in these playoffs and just, you know, the entire year. We're going to see more Six Guy highlights, by the way. But just, you know, enjoying the series throughout the entire year, man, and I really do appreciate it. And there we go, raising the trophy. It is official. The Six God is the man in Miami right now. Finals MVP. The fans are chanting MVP for the Six God. We did our thing. But, hey. If this is your first time watching the Stacks Montana video, man, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. You're not going to want to miss the offseason. It's going to be kind of crazy. Also, go ahead and drop a like if you're enjoying this series, and I definitely keep posting more. But until next time, players, real fans, stay up and I am out. Swag team, bruh. Zombie gang, cuz. They still chant MVP for the sixth guy. Um, I feel bad for whoever got to sweep up all of that confetti, but we did it. NBA champion. It's been a long season, but we finally did what we had to do. And of course, like y'all know, I'm always rocking on that Hall of Fame. Let's get it. Turn up NBA champions. Yeah.